Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you a motion capture live hack for your iClone 8 3D animation software. Just by using your webcam, your camera, or any of the MP4 video that you already capture, it can perform just an AI motion capture. And just by using my self made plugin for iClone 8, you can direct import the motion capture into iClone 8 software to make it become an iMotion, what we call the iClone Motion file or RL motions. So start from now, I'm going to show you step by step how to do this. It is really fast, it is really easy, just in three minutes. All right, first what we are going to do is just go to my video descriptions to get the 3D post tracker version 0.5.1. Just get it from this link, get it from me, then you should be able to get a zip folder then you extract the zip folder into your computer. You will get these three items. The first ones, I already given some of the sample videos for you. All of this video, I'm going to, to perform some demo for you as well. These are some, some of the, the sample video. Right. So now, next, you should be able to get the software. Or you can download the software from the official site as well. You can just go and search it. The 3D Post Tracker. Then, the third one is the 3D Post Tracker VBH Importer plugin for iClone 8 3D animation software. This is my self made plugin. It is an iAvatar form. So now we can start. First, you, you can just enter the 3D Post Tracker. Double click to open. Now the 3D post tracker is opened. Next, if you already capture some of the video, then you can use your own video. As demo, I'm going to use some sample videos, for example. For example, this. Now you can see this is just a, just a video capture, most and performed by a guy. We can try to use this. In order to load the video, just load the movie at here. Then copy the video destination option, Control C to copy, and then paste it here, Control B, and press Enter. Now I'm going to choose the sample video 01 as demo. And then you, you can see it start playing. Start the mocap as well. Alright, for, for this one, just because of the quality of the, the video, you can see the hand and fingers have some arrows. So now we can just go to the configurations. Then for this one, use the hand tracking, you can just turn it off first. If it has some errors, just apply. So the hand tracking is related to the fingers and the hand motions. You can activate it, you can deactivate it as well. It depends on your video quality. So for this time, as demo, I deactivate it. Now you can see another option. Another option is the, the mirror mode. You can see if I take the mirror mode, the mirror mode and I apply, it is going to, to have the mirror, mirror motions. Just like that, you have the mirror motions. The mirror mode, usually by default, it is deactivated. If you activate it, it is at another mirror image, that's all. So by default, I don't activate it. I click OK. Now you can see, it is going to loop the video. If you want to start from beginning, you just load again the movie. Just now is this one. Then it is going to start from beginning, then you can click record BVH. Now it is start to record, record as BVH. Now, once you click again the recording, it is going to stop recording and ask you to, to save, save a motion. So for this one is, I'm going to save it at the same location. Use this name, Control C to copy, I paste it here. Sample video 01. Then I put A, for example, A, later B and C, something like this. 
click here it is going to export as bvh file let's say if i want to load another video it's okay for example this video or michael jackson is okay let's say i load the michael jackson's video it is going to load from beginning now actually at this moment just don't record until you can see something that you want to record just click record okay now i record now it is already start to record then stop recording it is just a while this is the sample video 03 sample video 03 03a these are just example now i already successfully recorded as the bvh this is the mock cap this is the motion capture and next always remember in this tutorial i'm going to show you after you perform the motion capture by using the camera or mp4 the video how to use my self-made plugins for icron 8 to import the bvh file to make it become an rl motion the icron motion file it is pretty simple you back to the previous page right here you should be able to see a 3d post tracker bbh importer for icon 8 this is an i avatar this is my self-made plugin for you everything really make make, make it easy so you can open your icon 8 just start a new project don't save this now at here you drag in your 3d post tracker bbh importer to the center to the origin like this next open the b the bvh file the mocap that you already saved just now one by one let's say the sample video 01 bvh drag in drag and drop into the icon into this avatar it is going to pop out a conversation the character profile was no applicable character profile was found this one you can ignore you click okay then here just click convert all auto generate to perform list it convert all all right then once done already you have to, to save it but how to save you go to the window workplace standard then after that you click this the show timeline then you scroll down you should be able to see a motion here right click it save the motion clip and then of course i'm going to save it at here copy the, the video uh, sorry copy the folder destination location and then i click here Control v to paste it here the file name i'm going to put same as the bbh file name i press f2 Control c to copy and Control v to paste it here this is the file name it is going to save it as rl motion i click save next start a new project again don't save now I have another one that is the sample video 03 one of the mocap there so drag in the 3d post tracker let's drag in then go to the bvh file drag and drop into this plugin then click ok click convert all do the same step at here scroll down you should be able to see a sample video 03 right click save save the motion clip save it here use the same file name as the original bbh file press f2 Control c to copy the file name click here Control v to paste the file name click save now i already have two rl motion file at here where is it this one is here another one is here so i right click view with details and then sort the file types i should be able to see this is the Revolution motion file. I have two. The sample video 01A, sample video 03A. These two are the RL motions. This is the icon motion file. Back to the icon 8. Click the window workplace standards. And as there are more, I'm going to just use one of the, the avatar here, the actor core crowd. And I start a new project, I don't save it. This is just a demo. I try with two avatar here. right now two avatars are here what can i do back to the rl motions so now the first sample video 01 rl motion i drag and drop into this female 
is women. Then another one, the sample video 03, I drag and drop into this guy. Sorry. Again. I want to change it just because of the sample video 01 is a guy, it's a man, then I drag to the man. <laughs> okay. The sample video 03 belongs to a woman. So I drag and drop to the woman. Now try I try to play. You can see they are really the mock-up, the motion capture that performed just now and recorded just now. This is the motion capture. This is the mock-up. Right. So everything ready, well done. That's all for today about my tutorial on the motion capture life hack for your iTron 8 3D animation software. It really can perform the motion capture very fast. This is a really fast mock-up. And then Use my self-made plugins. You already can just import the BBH mockup into iCron 8 to make it become the RL motion, the iCron motion file here. Alright, that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial and sharing, if you feel all these tutorials and sharings are very helpful to your 3D modeling, 3D animation, and game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorials or sharing, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy! Happy 3D modeling, 3D animation, and 3D game developing. See you!